guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have another haul for you guys. Now, I know I just did a haul, but there were things that I kind of collected over a little while, and these were specific things that I got for Coachella. So I really wanted to share them with you ahead of the weekend. I'm going to Coachella weekend too, and a few brands very kindly sent me some pieces to wear over the weekend, which I'm super excited about. And I really wanted to share with you guys um, there is quite a bit to get through and I want to do a bit of a try on haul as much as I can. So I am not going to talk too much. I also have a few bits of makeup from Tarte that I want to show you. They kindly sent me over some amazing things to wear and put on my face over the weekend and my hair and my body. That's some really good stuff. So I can't wait to share it with you guys. Let's get into it. Okay, so first up I have a bag of goodies from Toby. As I mentioned in my last haul, they had sent me some things previously. So um, what I will do is, I have actually opened all of these bags just to like see what it was, but I haven't actually taken anything out of the packet. So I'm very excited. So the first bit's a swimwear, so I'm not going to try any of these on, but if you want to see what I end up wearing, I will be sure to post loads of Instagram pics over on my Instagram, which is at electromosa, so be sure to follow me over there. So first up, I have this gorgeous swimsuit. Oh my gosh, I love this. I really wanted to pick up um, a swimsuit. I am very much a bikini girl. I am always just like really not into the idea of a tan line, but um, I really like this one. It has a super low back and low sides. And I kind of just thought I wanted an option of something else. And um, I'm kind of trying to lay out in the sun less at the moment. So, you know, the tan lines won't matter as much. And honestly, like, I probably won't get anything other than no sun on my tummy if I wear this. It's really nice high, um, kind of, uh, what they called high legs on them. And it has this pretty ruffle. Yeah, I really like it. Sorry, I'm looking down there. There is a monitor right there that I'm looking at. Um, yeah, I really like this. I think as long as it fits, I will definitely be wearing that one at some point. Then I got this set, which is so cute. It looks so gorgeous on the model. Also, let's have a look at the bottoms. I love the packaging, by the way, that Toby put this in because how handy is that? That's like a bikini carry or, or like you put your makeup products in there. Oh my gosh, I'm definitely going to reuse these. So cute. Um, so the bottoms of these are quite like... Brazilian style, they're not like a thong, but they're like really small, which is what I like in a swimsuit. I like a higher cut bikini rather than something that's kind of bigger, I guess. It's just the preference I have. I think it makes your butt look a bit better. Um, big or small, if I'm being honest. Anyway, uh, I really like this. I love the print, it's just black with flowers, and that's super cute. And then let's have a look at the top. So what I also loved about Toby's swimwear is they have loads of like mix and match, so you could do like, a different style of top with a different style of bottom and like different colors and print so it's like it's a little bit like Victoria's Secret have that on their website as well oh this is so cute super simple V strappy back I got all I got all the swimwear in an extra small um, and yeah I think this is so cute it's quite tiny but that looks like it will fit um, yeah love 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 those then, oh yeah, I got one more bikini set, which I'm excited to see because this was a bit of a risky colour. I don't know if you can see, but it's like a tan. And let's look at the top first on this one. Um, I just kind of was like drawn to this colour, even though it could make you look really like washed out. Oh my god, this is so cute. So it's a really simple strap across the front with like... Um, hard a bit so it like goes across the boobs like that and it's just straight really really simple really 90s and then it has this kind of crisscross back detail so that's really cute that could even be like a cute top at Coachella to wear under like with denim shorts or something so that's super cute and then the bottoms is what really I was I really wanted so these are so cute oh my gosh they're amazing in my life ah, so excited about these so these again are that kind of Brazilian style they're actually a bit fuller on the butt but not too full and then they have this kind of tang crisscrossy side detail you see what I mean about this colour it's either gonna look make me look really pale and washed out or like really good colour I'll probably do a little fake tan before I leave because um yeah I'm not really very tan right now um yeah these are so cute I'm super excited to wear those then the last few bits from Toby I picked up some new denim shorts 
And I really liked these because of the button detail down the front. I just thought that was really cool. And there's nice distressing on them. The pockets looked like they were in a really nice place on the butt. These do look a little bit big, if I'm being honest. These are a size small. I'll try them. They look a little bit big for me, but we'll see. Yeah. Um, but they're really cute. I love the button detail down the front. I think they're really, really cute. And fingers crossed for those. Okay, so unfortunately these shorts are a definite no. I thought they looked really big. They're huge on me. Like, I mean, absolutely massive. They're so cute though. They don't, they didn't do an extra small, so I thought a chance a small, but they're just, they look kind of ridiculous. I think they're supposed to be like up here and then like quite tight because that's kind of how the, how the model had them. They just look like I'm wearing my mum's shorts, not in like a cool mom short way, just like eh. They just don't look good, so these are a no. And then, finally from Toby, I got a set, which, sorry, I'm like dropping everything everywhere. Um, I saw this and I was like, this is just everything I show that's me. So freaking cute, I'm obsessed. Oh my gosh, yes! This is so cute. Um, so it's a little like um, strapless, like stretchy top that goes across the boots and it has like ties in the back and has the little like off shoulder sleeves you'll see better when this is tried on and then to match i got these shorts which oh my gosh you guys this is gonna look so freaking cute i really hope this all fits and looks nice um and again the matching little like mustard colored shorts oh my god they're adorable i have some old fringe boots that are like suede i think they're from um new look that will look so freaking cute with this. I wish I had like a little headscarf. Maybe I'll get one that will look adorbs with this. So let's try this one and see. Fingers crossed. I got this in an extra small as well, guys. If you okay, so first up, we have this adorable little set from Toby that I love. Um, I think the fit of this is really nice. Now, the back, let me twizzle around and show you guys, is just held up by these two ties. So if you have kind of bigger boobs, might not be the option for you guys, but. I haven't got much to hold up, so I'm in a good spot with these. And I just think this color is really cute. I really like the um, kind of floral detail on them and the ruffles. And these are those boots that I was telling you about that are like my old Coachella faves. And yeah, I really, really like this. I think this would be like such a light and comfortable outfit. You throw like a khaki jacket over on with it and they're just like stretchy and comfy and this will be such a like fun, relaxed outfit but also just looks so cute probably do like a bunch of necklaces and then i have these earrings that are from claire's i mentioned before that i'll probably wear on oh, no, icing they're from that probably wear yeah and i think this is just like an easy comfy outfit i love the kind of stretch element and uh yeah this first one is an absolute winner okay so next river island i have a huge bag here that i just picked up yesterday from um, fedex so i was like so excited to have it uh river island by the way i went on the website to pick some things and everything is amazing on there like i really really struggled to pick like a couple of few pieces because honestly there was so much good stuff i was so so impressed so if you guys have checked out river island recently make sure you check it out so the first thing I got, sorry, there's so much packaging, was, oh my god, this is amazing, was this bag. It's so cute. I want to wear this with like all my outfits the whole weekend. It's yellow and it has like all this embellishment on it. This is like a long rope strap that can kind of go crossbody. Oh, this is so cute. We stand up. Um, Oh my god, I'm obsessed. Crossbody, which is fun dancing out of the tassel. This is like an additional, like such a statement accessory to have with your outfit. I love that. Even if you're just wearing like this white dress, how cute will that be? And I'm definitely gonna use this a ton over the summer. Oh, it's so cute. And I picked up this another cute little set. Now this was advertised as like um kind of swimwear cover up. It's in the like swim section on River Island and I got both things in an extra small. Hmm, that's quite a big extra small, but we'll have a see. Um, I just loved the like mix of prints. I thought this was so fun with the pom-poms and the print. Even if I end up do wearing this as a bikini like cover up, I thought it was so cute. And I have a feeling that the top is actually, yeah, I think it's waterproof, the top. 
I think you can get bottoms to go with this as a bikini top, which I love that. You can like double up. This is such a good like Ibiza or summer outfit that you can just kind of multi-use. And I got both of these actually in a size. The bottoms I got in a extra small and the top is in a size six. It looks like it will fit. Um, and I just thought, I mean, can you believe how cute that is? This is gonna look adorable. Can't wait to try that on. Okay, so with this set, I love the top. I think it's so cute, it fits really nice. I love the idea that this is a bikini top that can then be worn like out as a top. So if you're going kind of from beach to bar type of vibe, but these shorts are massive. Um, I don't know whether I've got like a wrong pair. They are an extra small, but there's a part of me that wants to like put them in the wash and see if I can shrink them a tiny bit just because they're huge. And the other thing is, like honestly, I wish if they went there, that's maybe what it is. I want them to be a little bit more high-waisted. I just don't know if I'm like, maybe I will be at Coachella confident enough to just like rock a whole belly out situation. Um, I could wear them super low. Um, I just don't know if this is my vibe. I feel like I'm literally in my bikini. The other thing is I could just wear this as like a beach day cover up situation I could get some black I think I might even have some black bikini bottoms and wear this as an actual bikini and then just have these shorts to throw on over that could be an option because I would be cool with that but yeah I'm not really sure not 100% but I really like the general idea so let me know what you guys think in the comments because you always have very good advice um yeah I don't know then so it can be really cold at night at Coachella and I kind of like I've worn jumpsuits a few times um, before and I saw this one and I thought this is going to be so good for the festival, I thought with a really cool belt or if it doesn't work for the festival, if it's a bit too dressy and doesn't really work, I can always um, hang on to this and wear it for something else, I've lots of like, weddings and things this summer. So it's kind of like strappy polka dot and then it goes down and the best bit about this, obviously it's a gorgeous print and really nice shape but the bottom has this like roughly detail which I just thought was so fun with a big statement belt around it. Um, yeah, I'm really into this. I really hope this looks cute. Like I said, this would be a good festival outfit or it could be a good um, event or like wedding outfit. I really, really liked that one. Now this, I love. I love the whole vibe of this. I just think it's really fun. It's a little bit big, so I might have to have it tailored or I could put a belt kind of around the waist, I was thinking, just to give it a little box shape. But how fun are these like pants? Oh my god, they're so cute! And I like, it's a really nice fit, kind of. I could like use like this out of it. The problem is it's because it's got this elasticated back, so you've got to kind of get in and out of it. So maybe I'll get like a zip put in and just have it tailored a tiny bit more in the top and just kind of get that bit of fit because I really, really like this. Um, I could probably get away with this at Coachella if I just did a belt like this and made it a little bit more bunchy at the waist because that would give me the shape without having to like do the whole tailoring but I think it's adorable and the straps are adjustable they're just fully down so I probably would hoist them a little bit but yeah I absolutely love this I just think it's so fun and like salsery. <laughs> then I got another kind of beach cover-up but I think I could wear this as a dress in the summer or as a beach cover-up and it this bright yellow colour, which is everywhere this season, you guys. You have to get something if you haven't. Um, and I just loved all the kind of pom-pom details in the front and the crochet. And the bottom has this kind of pom-pom detail as well. I just thought it was really pretty, really lightweight. Again, it's from the beach collection, so I think it's actually considered a cover-up. But you could totally wear this anywhere that's hot as a kind of beach dress or a day dress. Okay, so with this yellow dress, just so you know, you can see black. I've got the Toby bikini on underneath which by the way fits super nice I'm really happy with those and um, this dress is gorgeous I absolutely love it I love all the tasseling it's really pretty in the back it looked great with some sandals um, again super see-through because it's a beach cover-up it's not lined um, so I feel like this would be great if you were somewhere hot and you were obviously wearing a bikini like maybe you got a yellow bikini or something to go underneath and match but otherwise you're gonna have to like think about underwear a lot with this because it's got this kind of cut out in the back so I don't really know cool can you see that I don't really know what bra situation you would do unless you did something really low maybe you could get a yellow bralette and then like nude underwear like knickers I don't really know but anyway love this dress I think it's really sweet I'm definitely gonna wear this um, as a beach cover-up while I'm at the festival because there'll be a lot of sunbathing days. And yeah, 
obsessed. I really, really like this. I think it's quite fun and hmm. Then another thing in the same kind of vein, it's again in their beach collection, but again, I probably will wear this like as a dress. Oh, this is called River Island Resort. That's what it's called. Um, is this little dress. And I thought this was so adorable. It's like high neck with lace and print. It has a tie neckline, has cutouts, it has a ruffle, and it has ruffles at the bottom. I mean, can you get any cuter? really hope this looks cute. It's the kind of thing that just would be so good, like I say, as a beach cover up. You can go out that night for drinks in it. And yeah, this would be great for kind of all festivals with some little boots, Le leather jacket. Okay, this dress I love. I think this is so pretty and cute. I love all the like details in the neck here. The cutout is really flattering. It kind of just looks like it's part of the pattern, but it kind of gives a nice shape to the dress. It's like really light and cute. And I could throw like a leather jacket over this if I was going out in the evening or little boots or at Coachella I could wear like sneakers or little ankle boots. I just think this is adorable. I um, love this one. I just love all the details on it. I think it's so pretty. Let me know what you guys think. I think this is quite affordable. It's 28 pounds, which I don't think is too bad for like a dress that's kind of like doubles as a beach dress and as a like going out dress. I think this is so cute. And it's like a really nice, really nice cotton material. Yes, this one's a winning one. And I got a bit of a wild card piece. Um, not that everything's not wild card because you never know. But I thought, saw this dress and I was like, this is amazing. And if, like I say, it's too dressy and doesn't work for Coachella, I've got a million occasions for this. How stunning is this dress? Oh my gosh. I love the big food sleeves and it's kind of like you see in the front there it kind of gathers and then it splits in the front so I've got like I say some weddings coming up in the summer and lots of summery events I think this would be perfect for so fingers crossed this works I am beyond in love with this dress I think it's so elegant it's so interesting she this this ruching you can kind of ruche it as much or as little as you want but I quite like, I like a lot of ruching it's on the bigger side so it's not very flattering on the side at the moment but it's got a zip so I'm thinking of having it like really pulled in there and then you've got these big amazing sleeves this I don't think I'm going to be able to wear for Coachella but um, I have quite a few events coming up so I'm definitely going to get this tailored because oh my god it's stunning I have these like bright pink heels I just think would look so great with this like right now it's really hard to see but I just oh, I can't get enough of this I just think it's absolutely stunning River Island are just killing it right now this is just such a great option this will be so amazing at weddings I just think it's a great like statement dress but not too much um it's light it's comfortable I just yeah yes so into this so then finally, Tarte sent me this enormous box, oh, I'm trying not to show my dress there, enormous box of stuff, which I have had a quick peek through, and it's amazing. There's so many cool things in here that I've never seen. Um, a lot of it's from their Mermaid collection. So what I thought I'd do is I'd show you a few like highlights from the box of stuff, because um, there's honestly so much in here. First up, are you serious? Mermaid brushes, these are so freaking adorable. Let's open them up. They, in this little set, you get five brushes. Oh, I can't, these are so cute. I don't even want to use them, they're so adorable. So you've got like two um, eyeshadow brushes, you've got big, two bigger kind of brushes, one for foundation, one for blush maybe, and they're just, I just can't. They're so cute. What a lovely, like, gift for someone. I have so many friends that love like mermaids and unicorns and all that good stuff that would love these. I'm super excited to use those. Then keeping kind of with the festival theme, they've got a few really cool like bits. So first up, they've got some um, eyelashes. And by the way, all of Tarte is cruelty free, which is awesome. And a lot of the products are vegan. So they're a great brand to kind of buy into, which I really love. And these lashes are that they're cruelty free and you probably can't see. So maybe I'm gonna try and show you. Here you go. They're multicolored lashes. They're amazing. I'm obsessed. I just thought, what a cute idea for a, a fun festival lash that isn't just like your regular eyelash. And then they also do these semi these sets, which I love. Um, they're kind of just multi 
mermaidy gems and I always love to do some stuff like this they've got lots of different ideas how you can put some on your chest and like on your cheeks and like down in places um, and I just love kind of getting dressed up like this for festivals it's like the only time you can really do it and a really good tip with gems like this if you have gems that have like that kind of crappy backing and don't stick very well get a little bit of eyelash glue dab it on let it dry a little bit pop it on and it'll be on all night so that's really good and then oh my gosh there's so many good things in here I can't like don't know what else to show you. They sent me some glitter. This is amazing. It's called Get Festival Ready Mermaid Glitter Gel. It's just like gel stuff. They sent me these eye chromes, which um, this is 100% being used. Like a really sick gold eyelash. I'm very excited about that. Then some two, like a body product and a hair product they sent me. They sent me this. This is the Mermaid Waves Salt Spray. Really excited to try that. And the Mermist. This is like a body shimmer spray. Also going to be amazing for Coachella. They sent me a bunch of different like lip products that I can't wait to use and then this palette is beyond. I'm so excited to look at this. I've seen this on so many people's like Instagrams and things. A friend of mine has it and she I'm always like oh it's so beautiful. It's a shell. It's holographic. Oh my god it's stunning. How pretty. Oh my gosh you guys that is beautiful. There's some shimmers and some colours and, and some mattes in there. It's actually this is actually quite a good palette because um the blues and the greens would be really nice for like festivals and some fun and these kind of warmer shades would actually be just really nice all the time. I'd actually probably use this palette a lot um, and I don't know if you can see there but on the middle oh yeah you are on there it says 100% or oh, 99% mermaid and that's a really really nice size mirror. You guys amazing and that is it you guys i really hope you enjoyed this haul i'm super excited to go to coachella this weekend did you go last weekend let me know in the comments down below who's your favorite what should i see what shouldn't i see um and yeah let me know what other types of videos you'd like to see on my channel as i mentioned everything i mentioned in this video will be linked in the description box down below so be sure to check that out go follow me on instagram and follow all my adventures i will be going to coachella tomorrow which is exciting um and yeah i will see you guys very very soon oh also i'm vlogging this week so let me know by giving this video a thumbs up if you're pumped for that too and i'll see you later